Mrs. Mo got that for me, I'm liking it. So welcome today. I thought it would be fun to start out with something new and we're gonna get into the gambling stocks out there. I did a lot of research today and what I found is very thought provoking and I feel as though this is a stock, I should say stocks. I have three great stocks that I think are gonna double within the next 10, say 12 to 24 months and you're gonna to wanna to stick around. And that's like I said, I think you're gonna like what I got for you. For those new to the channel, I'm Stock Mo, I'm an old stockbroker and financial planner, now comes out there and teaches the masses all kinds of finance and investing in the college level, high school level, all kinds of crazy stuff. At the end of the day, I like to come here and just go over the market, what stocks I see doubling, and the big possible profit makers for us for our portfolios. Uh, now all I ask in return for all this is hit that subscribe button over there, hit that little bell, hit notifications, hit all, you'll get a notification every time I put a video out there, which is awesome. And you can see some of the new stocks like the ones I'm gonna talk about today, which I think are gonna double here within the next year or two. And I'm feeling really good about that. But more importantly, get those four free stocks. This is real limited. You put a hundred bucks in, they give you four free stocks, guaranteed $21 or more. And you have a shot to get over a thousand dollar stock. I think it's up to $1,600 stock on two of them. And two of them you get a shot for two, uh, $200, $250 stocks. I get one free stock as I'm affiliate. That's why I say this every time. It's good stuff. I love their program. I'm gonna be using it today, their desktop, Weeble desktop. And uh, of course you can get it online as well. I also want you to go over and check out my Patreon. Come over and join us. I have all my stocks over there, my portfolios, all kinds of good stuff. And we have one of the best discords out there, in my opinion. Uh, we have thousands of people that just talk stocks. We have a great team. Uh, all my portfolios, all my stock picks, anything I'm buying and selling is over there. If you want to see it, it's fantastic, and you'd help you sort. You'd be helping to support the channel more importantly. So let's get into it today. It was an interesting day in the market. I do want to say, just start out because I know uh, a lot of people always, you know, question how's the portfolio going and what have you. Today we had the Nasdaq up about 0.5 percent at the end of the day. The portfolio did fantastic. It was up. 1.5%. A lot of that is because of the uh, Bitcoin and Ethereum. I've been saying you have to stay, according to that old Yale and uh, university study said, you know, you want to be diversified with that. I think I put in uh, $1,000 into that account and to um, help diversify, but I can tell you personally, I have, a, oh, I have a lot more than that in my own personal account, which did very, very well today. So it was a very, very good day, but I do put about 10, Oh, to 20% of my own funds between there at any given time in cryptocurrencies for those who wonder how I diversify. And the other 80 to 90% is in equities. I'm very high risk. So always remember that's something that I do uh, to take some, I, I've been in the cryptocurrencies for many, many, many years. And so I, I do see where they're going and I understand a little bit. So that's why I invest in it. Now, let's talk about today. I have some really good stocks I wanna talk about. I have three of them and I have a ton of notes. So this is one of these videos for those who watch that I'm gonna be doing a lot of classroom stuff. I'm gonna be talking about why these stocks are gonna be big, not just say, bye, bye, bye. These are the next big ones. You know, these are, I'm gonna to try to explain so you understand why I'm putting a lot of my own personal money into this. I know a lot of us out there like the EV industry. I can tell you right now it is my highest uh, percentage of money is invested in the EV and it will continue to be as we move forward. I'm starting up a new growth fund over at the um, Patreon. I was doing that in the first week of January and I can tell you right now it is going to be a lot of fun because I have some big plans to have fun with that and it's gonna have EVs, but it's gonna be well diversified. But one of the fields I'm gonna be putting stocks in there is going to be the gambling industry. And I'm gonna talk about three stocks that I think have the great opportunity to double. I think one of them, um, there's two, one or two of them I think is gonna be the first to double, and I think the third will lag, but it should double as well, probably after two to three years. But this is, this is what I got, so let's get right into it. You'll see the three stocks down here, and I'm gonna talk about them. I, and I've, I've discussed them, but not in this detail today. So DraftKings is the big one, and if we look at DraftKings, I've already said in multiple videos, back when it was in the 40s that I thought it would be doubled up to 90 by the probably the next 12 by the end of 2021 I felt good about this because sports would be back everything would be normal and I could see a lot of states legalizing it so we're going to start with this and like I said it's going to be a little bit different video now uh, just because of how I am doing this so as I get into this we're going to start with this we have 
that global online gambling could get to $92.9 billion by 2023. It's already at 59 billion. So you're getting up there about 80%, um, 70%, let's see, 60 to 70% increase from where it's at now and under the next three years, not even three years. It depends when they're going by 20, uh, 23 is at the beginning. It's only two years and a month. So it's not long, but this thing's getting close to doubling in under three years. And that's according to Statista that they see that New York is readying a bill online gambling and legislation in their next revenue bill to bring New York into the fold for the online gambling. And this is huge for DraftKings. Illinois just has uh, mobile sports betting, iGaming in West Virginia. They're a part of all this. Tennessee just got uh, a launch and now DraftKings has a foot in 10 different states and that covers over 20% of the population. These are good things that I've been reading about. They signed a deal and this is one I thought was pretty cool. So what I really like is that DraftKings signed an exclusive deal with Disney and Disney owns ESPN and it was the to be the co-exclusive sportsbook link out an exclusive daily provider of fantasy sports and that is awesome. So that's huge because we know Disney they have that good image, they got that big ESPN, and they had to make a choice, and they went out there and they chose uh, DraftKings, which I think DraftKings is going to be the monster. I've been saying this before, that if you're looking for the best stock to, to buy now, that should double in the next year, two, three. To me, in, this in, in these industries, these growth industries, this is a big one. I know there's some people out there that have different industries, the EV, uh, the marijuana, we got the gambling industry, and I know some people, they don't like to touch some of these, and I get it, but uh, I'm, I'm not one of those. I do think that the online gambling in, is a great industry for people to go ahead and invest in, in terms of getting appreciation on their investment capital. I think that this is the future of how people go to the casinos and everything else, it's gonna be more online. I think people are just gonna be gambling a ton online compared to going to the old fashioned casinos. Now they're still gonna go, but you know, this whole pandemic has forwarded everything uh, by years and years, if not decades of people transferring to the online industry. So I do like what we're looking at there. And then of course they do have an exclusive deal with Turner Sports and Bleacher, Resport, uh, Bleacher Reports. And one of the other things I liked was that Daniel Adam came out, initiated a report and, uh, and uh, initiated coverage, and put it at a $100 price target. I have it at the 90 to 100 by the end of next year. So me and Daniel must be thinking a lot of the same things with this DraftKings, that this is a monster in the making and that they should continue to grow into other states as more states out there get it legalized. I said before that 75% of all states now have legislation uh, or have it legalized in the works. So we are getting there as a country and there's so like it or not, it's happening. So why not make some money off of it? And that's what I'm trying to do by picking the best. So a lot of people like to ask me about like DraftKings and some other things. So I will go into this just to give some people um, explain some of these other stocks as I have a LCA, as you can see on here, DMYT and they deal with iRush and Golden Nugget online gaming. So we're going to talk about those because you know, why did you buy them? Because I don't always come out there and put all my research out there because a lot of people get bored and you only want to be on here for so long listening to me drool. So as we go, you can see this happen. Why did this crash? This is because they raised capital. And we hear a lot of EVs raising capital. What happens after a company raises capital and they announce it? Most of the times when I'm putting a large stake into it, I get out of the stock. And um, because I know it's going to end up doing this most of the times, most of the times, the EV industry, I did not. It was a little different. It was um, something something told me it wasn't the drop wasn't going to be like this. Now, this one, I was in here up here, but after it dropped 10 percent, I got out and we got back in at the once we saw the recovery starting, which is good. And now it's been going up. And I've been saying that you wanted to get back into this. I always say after a big drop, get a 10 percent return. It's usually starting that next bull run and we can see it is. And you can see it had a little bit here and now it's starting to go back up, which tells me this stock is ready and primed to go. Good things are happening out there in legislation and uh, numbers are looking good for them as well. And that's the kind of stuff I'm looking for. Now, the next stock I wanted to talk about, let's go to this one. Let's get into Rush Street. 
And this is another stock that we bought a while back. I've been recommending this. This is a SPAC that is going to be merging with, uh, uh, with uh, Rush Street. And this is big, big stuff. And this is a little bit different than DraftKings. DraftKings has a da daily fantasy sports, has the sp online sports books, and you can go bet all kinds of sports everywhere with DraftKings. Now, this is a little bit different. They are going to be combining on December 29th at 10 o'clock, 10 a.m. into have a new ticker, RSI. So we are already in it. And you can see now that this is happening that a lot of people are starting to jump into it because I think they're starting to see the same thing. This is a dominant company. They own 16.3% of the market share out there for iGaming. iGaming is like when you sit down at the tables, you're playing blackjack, you go to the slots. That's all the iGaming is. So you got the sports books, for, and that's a lot in the daily fantasy, which I think of DraftKings. I wanted to cover all the avenues, and I wanted to pick the best. And you guys who follow this channel know that I try not to just go with the fear of missing out stocks everywhere. I try to find the ones that I think are going to be uh, industry leaders. And definitely DMYT, I should say, is, which is going to be RSI soon, is that kind of company for those that are unaware of the gambling industry. You're not, you don't, you know, you don't, might not follow it, but you're following me and you want to know some of the things. Uh, the gambling industry is something I actually wrote a lot of papers about when I was getting my master's degrees. For those that don't know, I do have two master's degrees, uh, one in uh, business education and I got an MBA, MBA as well. So I, I put way too many years in college. I think I was in college for like 10 years, which is ridiculous. But unfortunately, I had to quit twice because I ran out of money and get full-time jobs to pay for the college two different times. And that was tough because I didn't grow up with any money. And so going to college was not something that was just given to me. It was tough. I had to quit work as a construction guy for two years uh, to help pay for it. I had to quit, go to work, save up money, go back, ran out of money, quit, go back. Um, but I did well. I ended up, I never stopped and I kept, keep, kept going until I got a whole bunch of degrees. So that's, what, that's why we're here. Um, uh, so anyways, iGaming, here's the thing I like about iGaming. iGaming is actually forecast to be bigger than sports betting. And uh, there's a lot of different things out there that I read that it could be up to, you know, three, four, five times bigger, uh, if not even more than sports book wagering. Uh, one report I read said it, I think it said it could be up to almost seven times bigger. And so I want to have a leader in that industry because if that's that much money is rolling through there, I want to have somebody who's in there. Now, the 16.3% market share. Uh, of iGaming sports betting is not bad, but the nice thing is they, they're in Pennsylvania right now and they have 28% of the market share here in Pennsylvania. That's where I live and they're doing very well. And they believe they just got Casino Operator of the Year too. So they're doing real well uh, of what they're doing. Now the last one, and you can just see the stock, you can see it taking it off. This is not a, a reactionary video. We've owned this for a long time because anybody's been following those. I said gambling stocks are the way to go. I've been putting, you know, I told you one of my biggest investments. At one time it was the biggest, was um, uh, DraftKings. And I did have these stocks as well and uh, which I still have them and we had them back then but in my personal portfolio DraftKings was the largest and obviously so I'm in a happy mood today but Tesla overtook that as it continued to go up it's just crazy and some of the other EV stocks are up there as well the last one LCA so that was my in-depth for I uh, for um, Rush Street which is great and uh, interactive so the last one though is lca this is golden nugget online gaming i have talked about this stock quite a bit you can go back and check out some of the other videos so i won't waste a lot of time with this i will say that there are some good things going on rsi has combined with lca i should say rsi the um uh rush street and Golden Nugget Online. They, you know, I'm not talking about the SPACs, I'm talking about the two companies now. They actually teamed up and are working together in New Jersey as a kind of a partnership. And they actually have 30% of the market in New Jersey as they're working together. So they're doing well over there. New Jersey is a huge place to gamble. So they're taking advantage of that. And I, I can see partnerships and things like that working going forward. I can see, uh, I think Golden Nugget Online is fantastic. I know they had the live dealers where you'd actually see me sitting here and playing cards and you could watch. And so you feel like you're there, but you're not, but it, you know, it's not a computer. You're actually watching a dealer do the thing. So they have some, some interesting interesting things and I think they're going to be big too but the two that I think are going to be the biggest are going to be Rush Street and DraftKings for two separate industries kind of sectors if you will you have the the online um, sportsbook gambling with the daily fantasy for DraftKings you have the iGaming which is supposed to be even bigger 
than the um, sports book and all that. So that's the ones I like, but I also like LCA in there because I think that's a sleeping giant as well. These are the kind of stocks I think will double over the next, uh, I, I'm always a little conservative, 12, uh, we'll say 24 to 36 months. But I said, you know, in the next year or two, some of these I can see doubling very quickly as more states pick them up. And I, I think you're gonna see that. So that's my big update today. I know we like to talk about a lot of the EVs. I'll get back to it, don't worry about it. I wanna give you guys some new stocks out there to consider, a new industry to consider, because I do see this as a big growth industry. I think there's some big money to be made here, and it's not gonna be without its risk. But you know, do your due diligence, of course, be well diversified. If you don't have any stocks, and you're, you're all in one industry, always go out there, put some stocks in some other industries. I give you some really good um, stocks here to consider if you don't have any exposure to the growing gambling industry and you do want some exposure, these are the ones I'd go with. Uh, I told you my number one is DraftKings, number two Rush Street, which is DMYT. And that, like I said, that goes out on December 29th. You can wait till after you want to reduce your risk. If you want a little bit more risk, maybe it's going to continue the run up. You can go beforehand. Of course, LCA Golden Nugget Online Gaming uh, is another one. Um, so LCA is going to be doing that. They have a SPAC. That's the SPAC going in. Uh, with Golden Nugget, which is the merger, and that's gonna be some good stuff. So there are my three picks. I see big things going forward. Hopefully you agree. You saw all the charts on there. We have some good things. And it's, you know, we're getting we're getting close. So make sure you get those four free stocks down from Weeble. Take advantage of it. Maybe buy some of these stocks because uh, you're gonna get $21 for free and you can move that into whatever you want. A minimum 21, I can tell you, I have a lot of people who wrote me now that have gotten over $100 free stock. I've gotten multiple ones now, which is awesome. And I got one that was worth over 1,700, it was a Google stock. I think I looked at the odds, it was like one in 10,000 or something. So I got real lucky, really, really lucky. So come over and join us at the Patreon and we can talk stocks all day and uh, with the Discord and everything else and you can see what I'm buying and selling. So thanks for the support. And like I always say, let's get out there and make some money. Thank you.